Um, there's been a somewhat strange char character to, to this, this debate that Roger and I have had because um, supposedly he's uh, the liberal and I'm the neoconservative. But in fact, my objection to Iran's acquisition, my fundamental objection to Iran's acquisition of a bomb is not really a strategic objection. It's not an American or a pro-Israel uh, uh, objection. Uh, it's not, uh, um, it's, it's fundamentally a liberal objection. Now there was a time when liberals believed that liberalism had to be fought for. Liberalism had to be defended. That liberalism was not just a strategy of virtuous surrender to tyrants, whether they were totalitarian or authoritarian or messianic or sort of messianic or potentially messianic but with interesting nuances and twists that, uh, that Roger has, uh, has uh, um, described so, so admirably in, in his comp. The certain sets of values have to be defended and when they are so uh, grievously uh, violated in a country like Iran that calls for us to respond and respond forcefully.